what's going on? So I got some goodies on the truck we're gonna show you. So here's, we're gonna start with this little thing here. This is a receiver hitch pin that's locking. So you can lock your hitch to your pickup and hope that that deters somebody from stealing it without like getting a grinder or trying to cut it off and stealing it anyway. But we have one of those uh, Amazon stores here where it's like uh, overstock or returns or whatnot. So like I, bu I bought this thing like two years ago at that store, like pre pandemic, scared of COVID, whatever you want to call it. Uh, before all of that for 50 cents, uh, it was in the box. Uh, it's, I mean, it's basically brand new, three keys, a pin. You got these spacers. So you can set it for a two inch or a two and a half. Um, I don't know, so where, I mean, yeah. So there's that. And then this arrived the other day. I've been working, so I haven't had a chance to get into it. So here we have garbage. Garbage. The last hitch you'll ever need. This uh, didn't come from a store for 50 cents. <laughs> Obviously these things are kind of expensive, but uh, five inch drop, four and a half inch rise, dual ball with the two inch and the two and five sixteenths, black powder coated, and it fits your two and a half inch receiver. So obviously I've got two and a half inch on the three quarter ton. So I bought the hitch that works for that truck to give it the max. That truck and a six four liter gasser can pull rated like 14,230 pounds or something there. So this hitch is rated to 14,500. So I'm, I'm not limited by my hitch with my truck. If, if I need to pull something that weighs 14,000 pounds, my truck can handle it. But then I'm running a hitch that can only handle 10. Well, that's kind of a bummer. So anyway. More garbage, more garbage, more garbage. This is the B&W tow and stow. So it just stays in the truck. Um, these things can just pull out, flip it, use it whenever you want. Kind of a deal. Um, I've never owned one of these before, but I'm assuming you just pull these pins, and there she drops out the flips, and then you've got all these different areas you can set it for the height that you want, and then you just pull this pin, and you can go two inch, two and five sixteenths. Pretty sweet. Pretty freaking sweet. So, take our stuff. Take this. Oh, that thing's not light. Let's go over the truck. Alright, so, we will unlock this locking pin oh come on open the bag boy that was easy and then two and a half inch shank right to there and then now we can Kind of adjust our 
spacers where we want them to be. So I'm going to take a couple off. We'll take one more. And what we'll do is we'll put this in. And then I've got enough room on this side to put a couple spacers back on before I put its pin in. That's locked on there. So now, what I don't know, which is a valid point, is like, what is this locking pin rated for, for weight? So we might have to look into that. So anyway, the BMW tow and stow, 14,500. So then, pull this pin, pull this. I want two and five sixteenths ball. I got it. If I want two inch ball, I got it. And then if you're gonna stow it, just go there. Pull the two pins on this side. Drop it down, lift it up. Highest point. And bam, stowed. And then it just looks like that the whole time. And it's pretty flush with the bumper, so you don't like back into something. So, yeah. BMW tow and stow dialed um what else have we done to this thing uh weston the weston pro tracks fives step bars got those put on it um hold on i gotta grab my keys got the keys so put the Husky exact contour liners in it. Um, those things fit perfect. Did the did the full kit, so I got them front and rear. So those are nice. So floor liners, new Nerf step bars. And now the BMW, and that's uh, pretty much it for upgrades for right now. Um, she's ready to rip. Oh, I just got this too. See that there? I didn't have a remote start when I bought the truck, so I put the factory one in it because I only want to carry one fob. I'm not going to carry two fobs around so that I can start my truck from a block and a half away or whatever the range is. I just need to be able to start my truck in the cold weather because it's an outside truck. So uh, should just be one, two. Yeah. Yeah, and that's how she starts, so. Sweet. Thanks for watching.